Happy upcoming 2019, my friends. You're probably setting some career goals, some salary goals to achieve in 2019, just as I am. I hope you achieve great things. And one thing that will help you a lot is Salesforce certification. It might be complicated for you to understand which certification makes sense for you because there's so many of them. There are 25 Salesforce certifications. But don't worry, there's a very good document that we'll be looking at together, which will help you navigate the Salesforce certifications. They will help you see which are the six Salesforce tracks, which of them go in which order, what are some resources that can help you. Stay tuned, let's look at it. Great document. Salesforce made simple, a guide to certification paths. This is the certification Bible. It tells you what the six certification roles are, that there are 25 certifications and there are 100 plus training courses to help you prepare for those certifications. Administrator, app builder, architect, consultants, developers, specialists. This is a very good high level 4000 feet view of all certifications. For example, I have the administrator, advanced administrator, platform builder, platform developer, certifications, also a couple in here. And it made me realize that since I want to become an architect one day, I need to start getting certifications in here. But there are a lot of them here, so which one would I pick? So I would go down to the section about architects. And here it shows that the peak of being an architect is, of course, being a certified technical architect. I have a certified app builder, platform developer one. I need to make sure I get the the at the bottom very strong foundation so i'm planning to right now i'm planning to study for this and and this one as i'm working in my current job i notice i need to improve my knowledge of sharing and also i need to learn the best practice of salesforce development life cycle so let's say I want to focus on the identity and access management designer. Here is the identity and access management designer certification. It tells us that the recommended Salesforce experience for the certification is five plus years. I would take this with significant grain of salt because this is a generalization. If one is talented, learning fast, is energetic, they can take the certification after three years and it says that to prepare for the certification it takes at least 90 hours also this is a generalization right if one has experienced ha if one has a lot of experience with identity and access management they can uh, pre prepare for this exam very well and also it depends on how well a person prepares right if they prepare with focus if they have good study material one of the useful things with this document is that it tells you that to understand the basics they recommend the self-guided resources the trailblazer community and then to further improve one's knowledge they recommend these free documents like the identity access management designer guide and then here is a certification exam guide itself and if i open it and this document is great it's the exam guide for any exam you take, I highly recommend reviewing this thoroughly. This exam guide talks about the purpose of the exam exam guide, like who this exam guide for. Talks about the recommended training and reference documents. It gives an outline of the document. Gives sample exam questions, answers to those sample exam questions, and some information about maintaining the certification. So, this certification guide is fantastic for putting all these exam guides together in this one document as links. Furthermore, at the bottom of this page, we see an exam overview. Basically, it talks about what this certification is about. 
Understand configuration requirements of delegated authentication. Understanding configuration requirements of SAML. Right, and the related certifications for this are Mobile Solutions Architecture Designer, Sharing and Visibility Designer. And the certification has no prerequisites. So my friends, as you're setting your plans for 2019, as you're setting career goals, please consider conquering a couple of certifications. And this document would help you decide which of them could make sense for you in achieving your career goals.